The following video has been approved by the Jetty marketing team. It is rated Jetty for intense use of the word damn and many beaver related puns. This video may not be suitable for all beavers. Good morning and g'day mate. Welcome to another leg day marathon with me, Jetty. Everybody's there and exiting the apartment block. And today we're going into um into some optimizations. I want to optimize what we have. We, we, we have a nice colony. We have a second okay colony. But I really want to um, further optimize what we have. And there's a couple of building projects I want to get done. Uh, so first off, let's talk about the rear of the island. The rear of the island, because we have a couple of building projects I want to get done, we're going to be, um, well, ignoring the bottom of the island for a little while. Uh, so we're going to set all these to maximum priority. Uh, we're going to put back our uh, foresters. We're going to replant everything. At the same time, I'm going to put in three new builder's huts because I'm pretty sure I can run three builder's huts. We're also going to plant pine um, everywhere. I'm just going to replant all the pine. Not a care in the world. Through to about there, through to about, I don't know, here and here. And yeah, we, we, we're just going to plant down a whole bunch of pine. We'll rip the pine back up with as many choppers as possible. And uh, that's going to be the plan for right now. Uh, through to about there. Sure. Okay, that's plan number one. Uh, plan number two is uh, this this guy, this guy, this farmhouse. He's planting wheat. He can only access to a right about here. Now we have explosives. I am going to bring that down on the next level because we can. Uh, again, we'll set you to the highest priority and get that done. We have many, many builders, so hopefully they should be able to mow through these jobs fairly quickly. Uh, actually, I should assign more builders to all these workplaces. That sounds like a good idea. Okay, uh, that's what we're going to be doing here. We do have a couple of these guys that are paused. You know, have no timber. Uh, you have no timber. You have no timber. No timber. Uh, no timber. Who else? Uh, is that all of them? Surely that's not all. That was all of them. Uh, I just wanted to have the timber picked up before I demolished them. And there was a row in there. Cool. All right. Uh, that's what we're going to be doing down here. At the same time, I have told the builders that they can now get uh, onto this barracks. And get this barracks built because we do need more batteries. And the only way we get more batteries is getting more height. So we're going to enable that. We did get the wheat along with the... What are you cooking? Cattail. Cattail. Uh, we did get the cattail grist mill and also cattail uh, bakery. Bakery up and running uh, between episodes. Uh, the other thing I want to do is... Um, oh, oh, I want to come over here. I want to come over here. What I want to do is I want to extend out uh, this whole platform by three tiles. Three tiles. Yeah, no, two tiles. Two tiles. Uh, delete. Yeah, no, hang on. Uh, I want to put a new one in there. And... Two tiles. Okay, uh, our plan is we're going to run the road into there, uh, the road into there, and the stairs in there. We're just going to move everything over two tiles because I have a whole bunch of inventor huts. The inventor huts that we don't really need, now we have the number cruncher up and running. So we're going to remove all of those. I'm also going to remove that bit of road. Because we've removed that, uh, we're going to fill that whole area full of wheat. Uh, sure, you guys can just plant wherever you can plant, and we're going to end up moving the path to here. Don't know exactly how we're going to get the path there. We'll, we'll, we'll worry about what we're going to demolish and what we're going to keep in a little bit. Maybe we'll move it over another two tiles. I don't know. We'll find out. Uh, okay. So that's the next thing I want to do. Uh, next thing after that is... Ah, over here. Over here. What I want to do is we have uh, this farmhouse. It's being emptied slowly. Uh, we have this farmhouse has taken over this area, which means this farmhouse is also being set to empty. We have this farmhouse, which is also being set to empty because it's been taken over by this farmhouse. We also have, is it down here? We have this gatherer flag, which means I did have a gatherer flag in here now that I can't find. Maybe it's already gone. Uh, so we're just trying to maximize our, our land. Um, there's a number of things we don't need anymore. Like, I don't need the inventor huts. We've already deleted a whole bunch of them. Let's delete a few more. Uh, we don't need that one. We don't need that one. And we don't need that one. We also, uh, well, we don't need the campfires, but we'll keep them for right now. I don't need this hauling outpost because we have a hauling outpost over there instead. Uh, so you can go as well. I do want to come out here and I do want to add in room for a pump plus room for a pump plus a path 
plus room for a pump because we did the last episode have a side project where i wanted the beavers to build all these they got them all done they're all set to unfortunately i set them to no water they've now all been fixed they're all set to water allowed and they're all set to a desired cargo of zero we're also going to put another another tank tank that's the words i want uh we want water we want a tank uh, another tank in the right here so we're gonna put a tank there we're gonna put a little path along here and we're gonna put in two more pumps here here or three more pumps here here and here okay that's gonna be playing over here uh the other thing i want to do is i want to make you go boom and then i want to make your friend also go boom because I really like to get up some more Lido's, Lido's, uh, which is those four tiles plus those four tiles. On the count of, where are we, well-being, we can make a Lido. And if I could delete that one tile, we'd be fine. Uh, we've also, as you can see, have beavers coming over here and building this because I could put in another power wheel. We don't really need another power wheel, but I like power wheels. We could put another power wheel here. On top of that, if they can get that built, and I can put a levee here and a levee here, That'll stop this area getting flooded, which means I could actually plant some trees and other stuff down there. And in fact, I could probably demolish with explosives all this down, bring it down to a lower level where we could actually access all access and use all that greenery with uh, this particular forester. We'll see whether that happens or not, uh, but that's also another plan I'd like to get done. Uh, these are all not priority. We're, we're not in a rush for this. They'll, they'll get that stuff done when they get that stuff done. Okay, uh, but they did get... Not quite all explosives done, but most explosives done. All right, uh, so that's the plan for over there. On top of that, we do have the wood workshops up and running. We have a couple of gear workshops up and running. I want to put in another explosive factory, plus a, what, another gear workshop, plus another plank guy. And we're finally going to unpause the printing press. We're going to get the printing press up and running because why the hell not? That's pretty much what it boils down to. Uh, yes, okay. Next up, uh, this colony. This colony here. This colony here is hard at work. They're doing a few little things. One of the things I'd really like them to do is I'd like them to plant dandelions. Now, dandelions are used for medical equipment. Uh, currently, we keep having a whole bunch of beavers being injured. And I'm hoping if I actually treated them rather than just put them in a, uh, a medical bed in the main, you know, um, um, stairwell where everybody could stare at them all day. Uh, maybe they'd actually get better if I treated their wounds. So we're going to plant some dandelions over here. Now, the catch is I don't actually want the dandelions in this colony. I want the dandelions in this colony. So we're going to cheat and I'm going to remove this little shrub. And in here, I'm going to put a gatherer flag. That gatherer flag uh, will be able to access those dandelions in the other colony and bring the dandelions back. The other thing I want to do is I want to bring power over this colony. We technically have power right here. That's the uh, Mr. Fishy Beaver. Mrs. Fishy Beaver uh, is the only beaver that has uh, power in this colony, but I'd really like to improve uh, our power. So what I want to do is I'm going to grab some platforms and we're going to drag these platforms all the way across to here and then into the new colony. At the same time, oh, we need to unpause you. That'd help. Uh, at the same time, we need to go around this little stairwell. So, unfortunately, the shower needs to go away. Uh, that needs to go away. Uh, so, we can put our shower back. And we're going to need some double platforms. Double platforms? Triple platforms. There, there, and there. And our plan is going to be a simple one. We're going to grab a straight shaft. I'm going to go straight shaft to here. Uh, then a right angle, right angle, right angle, right angle probably put in a right angle just in case and then i'm pretty confident of what i'm doing here so we're gonna go with some straight shafts unfortunately this is building the way but once they're finished planting actually we might plant some more dandelions let's plant dandelions all the way down to there okay uh once they're finished planting some dandelions we can get rid of this forester and then get back to work in here another thing i want to do for this particular colony is obviously i need to shave the island still we're working towards that we're also uh, where are we? Can I get a forester? No, a lumber mill. No, no, no. A lumberjack. Uh, I want to put a lumberjack here. And the idea of that lumberjack is they're going to be able to shave what trees are around them. Also, hopefully get to the trees over here. I want to cut down the trees over here. No, actually, they're going to have to do a one cutting first. So that we can build them closer. So then they get over here. Because I want to cut down all the trees on the other side of the island. Uh, we also can get rid of that double platform and put in another large water wheel 
Uh, we're also going to put over here another gatherer flag because we can. Uh, do you reach further? Hang on, let's go with the wood flag because that's what I actually care about. You reach up to that tile and that orientation and the exact same. No, slightly further if you're facing that way. Okay, so we're going to put a lumberjack flag there and a gatherer flag there. Uh, and yes, we just want to shave anything we can off this island. The next thing I want to talk about is we're going to be putting a set of stairs in right here uh, so I can delete these parts. Because what I want to do is... Uh, actually, what I want to do is I want to speed that up. That's super high priority. That's the only thing I really want you guys to work on. Uh, I want to put in some houses. I want to put in some houses. I want to put in some apartments. I want to take the power drive into those houses and then do something with it. Uh, can we actually drag that right the way through? And then into about here. Uh, whilst we wait. That'll go to there. Uh, actually, I don't have to... No, I do want to go up. I do want to go up. I want to have beavers to get access underneath. That's fine. Uh... There to there to there to there. Okay, we've put in that path. Great. Because uh, what I want to do is I want to delete everything between there and there. I'm intentionally choosing this one spot because water travels for about 13 tiles. Uh, well, uh, moisture. Moisture travels for about 13 tiles. But as we go up a step, it travels for less distance. Uh, funnily enough, when it goes down a step, also same issue. So I'm figuring right about here is actually a dry zone. So because it's a dry zone, I want to put our housing right here. One two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we're going to go with here. Uh, do we go one to left? No, that should do us. All right, so the plan is we're going to bring in a nice little path into these guys. At the same time, I want to go up to the next level. I want to build another set of row houses on top of our row houses. Uh, I also want right angle there, plus a platform, and then a shaft. Okay, I want to access the next level. So we're going to have a... Gotta work backward. Uh, okay, we're gonna go in double platform. And double platform. Also double platform. Uh, I want a three. I want a two. I want a one. I want a stairs. Stairs? Stairs. Stairs. Okay. Uh, stairs, 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 stairs. And then once we're up to here, we can access uh, this level. Okay, once I can access this level, I want to go with double platform. Uh, double platform. Uh, double platform. Double platform. Double platform, double platform, double platform, double platform, double platform. Okay, which means we can grab our path, uh, which is... Where did I leave my path? I left my path over here. Okay, so we put our path in right here. Then we go stairs, we go stairs, 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 stairs. And that'll get us up to here. And swing back around this side. And double platform. There we go. I uh, got there in the end. Okay, and that brings our stairs over to here. Also means housing are uh, row houses. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. With that done, we're going to swing back around this side. And we're going to go with platforms. Uh, doubles. I want to go with many doubles. Many doubles. Then we're going to go stair, 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 stair. And platform. Uh, well, path. Okay. Uh, let's come to this side and let's just count our housing. So we're going to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1. Nope, nope. That's the top of the skybox. Okay. Because we've got to the top of the skybox, can I put in an elevator? I cannot. Great. That's what I thought. All right. So we want to build as high as we can, which is going to be uh, four stacks of six. Four stacks. Yep. Of six row houses, uh, each carrying eight beavers. Four times six is 24, uh, times eight is 192 beavers. We're going to plan to have 192 beavers here. Also means that everything here is useless to me. I don't need any of that. Uh, I also don't need uh, you. Actually, can I just delete the top row? Okay, we want to come back to here because I do want to make some modifications before we get to the top. So I want to have stairs come up to here. Once stairs come up to here, I want a flat platform. Uh, we do need to have the top placed in, but I want to change things just slightly. I want to come sideways and then, oh, sideways and come on, from above, sideways. All right, the plan is... We're going to do this so we actually come in right into the middle of the top of the platform. 
Uh, we're going to put one of those there with a one height there, there, and there. That gives us a nice uh, flat platform to start with. All right. With our flat pa platform to start with, we're going to need some bonuses for the beavers uh, in their house. They're going to need a shrub and a roof to make sure that they uh, stay dry. Also a shrub and a roof. Notice how it can... Whoop. Notice I'm conveniently putting the how uh, the roof over the whole stack of how uh, well, or stairwells, uh, so at least as they're running up and down the stairs, they have a chance of staying dry. A chance. Uh, the other thing we're going to throw in is a statue, as this colony does not have a statue. We're going to be putting a statue here, here. Yes, here. Uh, the other thing we're going to do is we're going to go into power. We're going to go into gravity batteries, and I'm going to go one battery. Uh, two battery, uh, three battery, four battery, five battery, six battery, seven battery. Ah, sorry, statue, statue, you need to go. Uh, statue needs to go right here at the top of the stairs. Uh, actually, no, statue can go here. Uh, and one more battery. Uh, that's going to be a plan. Uh, this colony is going to be just a giant battery. It's going to be a giant battery. It's also going to have a giant amount of housing. Uh, now, the beavers wise, they should get the drive shaft done first, and then they should go into the housing blocks. The housing blocks are going to take them a while, and we don't want to lose our bonuses. So I'm going to intentionally put a roof here and a roof here. 40 beavers at all times. Uh, that'll max out this housing currently. After we get these projects done, uh, and we get the first housing in, that's the point where I'm going to start demolishing the old housing and swap them across the new housing. Also, we're going to expand the population. I want to get all the trees chopped in this area. I uh, also want to get all the trees chopped over here. I uh, also want to put in... That needs to be low priority as well. I uh, also want to put in uh, just a couple of other stats, a couple of other boosts to this particular colony. We wish to bring the absence colony, uh, make them a little bit happier. Uh, on top of that, they don't have a lot of the niceties in life. I'd like to give them some niceties as well, but one step at a time. Uh, I did put the shower back. I did. Okay. So that's that colony. Over, back over to here. Uh, you still have carrots. Damn. Does nobody know how to empty this crap? Uh, prioritize. 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 Uh, prioritize. Yep. Uh, it seems like things are full. Uh, probably because we don't have anywhere to put things. Uh, you, you're also full. All right. What we're going to do is we're going to detonate that little boom. Uh, then we're going to put in a water dump. The reason I want to put a water dump in here is I want to greenify this whole area. I want to take the opportunity to plant in extra crops. We already have our uh, three grills up and running, and they've been tightly put on top of warehouses that they directly access. We also obviously have a storage problem, so we're going to go into storage. We're going to get a large warehouse. We've got one up here, one up here, uh, and then we need stairs to access them, so that's going to come from here to here to here to here to all the way along there uh at the same time i'm gonna put in two on that side and two on that side okay uh first things first we're gonna need stairs to get up then we're gonna have path thing to get into those two warehouses as for the stuff down the bottom we are going to put in well-being i'm gonna throw in a medical bed on this side plus a medical bed on that side uh, hidden underneath and then we're gonna put a shrine on top because why the hell not uh, that's pretty much my answer and we are going to up the priority on that uh, I need to have those warehouses done so we can empty all these other little warehouses uh, the beavers have finished building that they've built that they got one Lido in with that going boom that means we should be able to get the other Lido, other Lido, right there. Excellent. I will up the priority on you too. We've built in this little barrier, which means all of this is plantable now. Drought's back once again, and that means it's time to close these good old floodgates, uh, which are buried in here, and see how the drought works for us. Okay, uh, now, the actually, let's start with this district. So, uh, over in Absence, Absence, we managed to get our five houses up and running, which means I don't need this house, this house, this house, or this house, or this house. It's a great way to be woken up in the morning. I uh, also don't need that shrub or that little roof. Also means right here we can throw in some more carrots. Uh, with our carrots done and everything else, we can leave this colony. They have a decent amount of production to do. 
also, we have... Yeah, we have all the beavers. They just need to find a, find a place to live. Okay. Uh, it means that we're going to be getting uh, that one up and running. Uh, you, Oh, you're too far away. Really? I need to build some stairs just to build the roof. That's annoying. Uh, is there a workaround? Okay, hang on. You cost two and one. You cost one and four. So it's actually cheaper to build two roofs. Okay. Uh, let's put a roof. Uh, where are we? Roof, 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 roof. Uh, decorations. Roof. Put a roof there, and I'll put a roof there. You guys can have two roofs. Uh, at least until we get to the top. Once we get to the top, all this temporary stuff goes away. All right. Uh, we're going to get that done, and then we're going to start building up. Uh, we have a long way to go to build to the top. Uh, you're going to uh, down priority. You're going to down priority. And actually, I need to set you bottom priority and bottom. All right. Uh, they're going to take a while. They're going to take a while to get all that done. It's going to keep them busy. But at the same time, uh, I have already shipped over metal blocks and gears uh, into the drop-off point. So they have access to get uh, those materials when they need to. They have plenty of planks. They make their own planks, uh, providing power keeps up, which is a whole different story. Uh, they have plenty of timber. Beaver happiness. And we do not have a carousel or a mud bath. We do have lidos. We do have books now we have a shrine and a temple temple's only 2.8 because only half the beavers are visiting it if i just isolate to this colony it's still only half the beavers because only so many beavers are getting in a visit per day and they don't need to visit every day they just need to visit every couple of days also the carousel so what i want to do is i want to unlock the carousel yep and you're sizable okay if i put a carousel here actually Let's 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 do a couple of things. All right, storage. Uh, can I get a large warehouse? I want a warehouse there and a warehouse there. Uh, with that done, we're going to delete that road. Oh no! And then uh, well-being carousel right here. The biggest thing about a carousel is the kids ride it all the time. Because the kids ride it, they tend to age up faster, which to me is a giant bonus. I want to have the kids age up as fast as possible because the longer they are children, the less actual work they're doing. Uh, we're going to need to plug. Ooh. I need to plug into a building that sits on top of this section to get power. Uh, we're going to go with a three-way. It's just not worth it. Just put in fours. Uh, okay, hang on. What happens if I put in well-being carousel? Put in a second carousel right there or a second carousel right there. Uh, what building could I put at the back that's two tiles high? that I can plug into. What does a healer look like? Healer looks like that, which I couldn't plug into. Uh, we're going to put in two temples, uh, one here, one here. Then behind the temples, we're going to put in a carousel. Uh, it'll be here and here. It doesn't fix the fact that I still need to bring the power down, which was what was their first problem, which is just going to have to be a high-low shaft. Uh, I don't really have a choice. And we will have to bring the path up from that side because bad planning and you're you're in the way, but you're not doing anything. But then again, uh, we're going to run out of power soon. When we run out of power, I'm going to have to pause a whole bunch of things. Uh, pause, 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 pause. Uh, I don't actually need you guys running. We will turn on those wheels. Actually, wheels wheels he says uh we need bad beaver corner uh bad beaver corner is where all the bad beavers go i need to remove you uh let's try again bad beaver corner bad beaver corner uh we want a bad beaver there and a bad beaver there a bad beaver there and a bad beaver there uh because some beavers are just a little bit musty uh, a little bit rusty and they're just horrible little beavers all right the sun is just coming down to set and we have our bad beaver wheels up and running they are providing very 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 little horsepower into the main network you're not hooked to the main network uh we're gonna remove that shrine and i need a four-way connector of course i do uh we're gonna put in a four-way right there max priority uh, because you guys have been running doing absolutely nothing. Yes. Okay. Uh, yes. Uh, the batteries are officially run flat. So we need to, uh, do a mass pause because none of this is going to run anyway. Uh, nope. That orientation. Uh, that one. 
Oh, uh, all of those, all of those, uh, that, and that, and that, and those as well. All right, we need to mass pause everything on top of that. We definitely need to have you up and built. And we're going to have to hook into the main grid because we now have grist mills and grist mills require horsepower. And therefore, we sort of want them running. Ideally, I want to be able to produce some power during the day and store it in the batteries so we can run the grist mills and stuff when downtime, etc. Uh, also, especially if we get a carousel up and running, the children use that in the evenings. Uh, yes, so that's going to be a plan there. Uh, we do have half of this constructed, which is good. Uh, they have beavers, which is wonderful. I still don't know exactly what I'm going to do down here. I think I might just fill it full of treats. Like, at the end of the day, it really doesn't matter what we do. Uh, oh, actually, you're empty. Okay, so we're going to get rid of... Oh. Well, I don't mind if you're using the rooftop terrace. We're going to get rid of you. Uh, I have a gatherer flag in here. But I think... Uh, medical bed. Uh, now let's get rid of a shrine. And let's put you in here instead. You can still reach all those berries. Yes. Uh, we've set you to max and max. Which means I'm going to pause you and say prioritize uh the birthing pods will leave for the moment because yes i want to i want to rearrange this whole area i want to sort of optimize everything i possibly can uh which is probably going to need more explosives honestly actually with mass pause we've got 25 beavers who are looking for jobs too bad i can't get them just to you know walk around with explosives and drop them down uh we probably need more bad beaver hills Yes, yes. Uh, and as for Absence, Absence is... Has their first row of beaver huts up and running. Is building the stairs slowly. They're going to take some time. It is a one hell of a construction job, actually. Okay, straight off, you need two beavers. So let's migrate you across two more. Uh, on top of that... Uh, okay, what's our best access? So over here. Over here we could do with... Foresters. Uh, one, two, three, four. Uh, let's also throw a forester in there. Five. Uh, where else can we throw a forester? Uh, down here. Six. Uh, we can extend this road along now. Uh, seven. Eight. Uh, I want two more. I want two more. I want to find jobs for two more beavers. Um, pumps? We've got three pumps. Three pumps should be fine. Uh, I'm going to unpause you in case there's something you could do. Yeah, there is. Uh, look, you know what? We'll just throw another one out here. The forest is still pretty dense at the back. Okay. Uh, which means... Actually, they're all not lowest priority, so that should be fine. Migrate population. Uh, can I have another 10 beavers, please? We'll take you up to 52. All right, I think that's right. All right, so that's going to be that district. Uh, oh, yeah, and they're even building the wheels. Uh, yeah, berry picker can stay paused. We're not really in a rush for food. Okay. Uh, as for this colony, great, you got you running, except you don't have power. Uh, I guess then we need to get you finished. Also need to get that finished. Uh, bad beaver wheels, more bad beaver wheels. Okay, with a shrine finished, I'm going to remove that shrine, which means we're going to run a path directly into there. And then, well-being, we'll throw down a carousel right here. Uh... Yeah, I think the path's going to end up moving over a tile. In fact, I'm positive the path's going to end up moving over a tile. We're going to run up to here, which means I might even rearrange those stairs. Well, we managed to do it. Uh, we managed to get them both up and running, and um, they're running off battery. Um, it's definitely evening. We're definitely running on battery. According to these, they're all um, dead empty. But there's obviously some power in there somewhere, uh, which is great because... There we go. That's what I was just about to look at. Uh, carousel. 1.1. 1.1. And also... Uh, where is... 
Okay, Temple's 160. Can I just look at this? Well, blah, blah, blah. That's a lot. Uh, okay, 3.8 and Carousel 1.3. So more Lidos would definitely be preferable. Uh, what else would be preferable? Uh, more Lidos, more Sunflower Seeds. Yeah, we were trying to work on that. And Mud Bath, which is a little bit off. Uh, more Shrines. Um, I guess we can shove some Shrines in in odd spots. Uh, make a bit Shrine. Uh, throw a shrine in there, shrine in there, shrine in there, shrine in there, shrine in there. Sure. Uh, why not? Uh, we... I, I, I decided against putting down more uh, bad beaver huts um, because we're just so close to the end of the drought. We do need to still get up a medical, an actual doctor, uh, a healer, a healer. Uh, but at the moment, I think I'm going to wait to demolish this and then see if we can come up with a solution for here. Uh, are they marked to be cut? They are not marked to be cut. Uh, I want to cut everything between there and there. Because that's also going to join the Maple Club. The other thing I'm thinking is maybe with the... Is that Maple? It's Chestnuts. Oops. Uh, cancel. Cancel. Uh, maples. Well, we only screwed up a little bit. Uh, can I change that back to carrots before I end up with a maple right in the middle of my... <laughs> you do work at the farmhouse. Good. Uh, before I end up with a maple in the middle of my um, farmland... Uh, yeah, I, I, I... Doctor in here somewhere? I'm looking, can I build it on top of something? And the answer is sort of yes, no, maybe. Uh, and actually, that's probably not marked to be cut either. Half it is. Uh, can we mark that to be cut and unmark all of that? Because I found the more areas set to green, uh, the slower the game gets to go, which is a bunch of fun. Uh, okay, so we're going to do that. Uh, that's all marked to be cut. That's all marked to be cut. That's all marked to be cut. Uh, the drought ends in 0.9 of a day. The beavers were bored, so they went and built this housing block. Uh, they're now also bored again. So there's a good chance they're going to start building that housing block. Uh, actually, no, they're probably putting in all the shrines. Yes, they are. Uh, all the shrines are in. Uh, actually, we'll throw another shrine down here. Um, all right, another thing I'm thinking about doing is we did throw in some big storage. Uh, these are unfiltered. They're just going to store up with anything and everything. Uh, desired, none. And desired, none. Actually, I should probably set these to be desiring food. Or limited only food. Meh, it's fine. Uh, what I do want to do is storage. I want to definitely set up a warehouse district. So we're going to go with one there, one there, and some paths. Uh, can I have that go there instead? And demolish that. Yes. Uh, can I get in storage? Large warehouse in there. All right. With that done, we're going to grab some platforms and put in platforms there, platforms there. Also going to rinse and repeat and do the exact same over here. Uh, I covered how to do a warehouse district uh, previously. Have a dedicated video on it. Um, it's linked up the top right hand corner if you want to have a look see. But our plan is going to be yes, a giant district center, uh, a giant warehouse. Uh, with that done, let's go into this. We're going to need to get up to uh, there. Uh, also across to there, also across to there, so, and into there. So what we're going to do is we're going to have a stair up, stair up, a height two. Uh, actually, let's put a height one. Yeah, you'll see why in a sec. Okay, so we're going to have path in and around to here, path into there. Uh, actually, okay. First off, I need to... That won't work, because I want to path through there. Okay. Uh, we want to path through here onto this side, so I can also put in a large warehouse back here. Uh, we're going to drag that into there and that there, so I can access that one. Okay, with that done, uh, well-being, the healer here. Sure. At the same time, uh, can I get in those plus 
that. Okay, so I'm going to bring uh, that across to there. Uh, and across to here. Yes, okay, with that done, we're going to go with storage, another large warehouse. Uh, these are often built right beside the district center because the district center influences the reach. And therefore, the closer you are to the district center, uh, the better reach you have. And we can then take the drive shaft, which I've already plugged into this warehouse buried under there, which is then going to transport up to this warehouse because it's sitting on top, which will then take this drive shaft into this set of warehouses, which will power up all these, which then, uh, can I get a one of those? And then where are we? Drive shaft, drive shaft. And then I'll hook that into that set. So this is also powered. Uh, just, I like carrying power through things, um, just in case. Just in case we want to tag onto something else later. Uh, it's already powered. Can I also just double check? I want to build there. And then we put another warehouse there. And same story. I'll do this all with level ones uh, because it gives me more versatility. Because this little tile in here that we is going to do a whole lot of nothing, we are going to put in. Uh, no, I can't put in a shrine. Put in a medical bed. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see. I'll find something to put in that area. I can always put in statues. 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 Statues can go... Statues can't go in. Oh, statues are two tiles tall. Uh, we can put in a park bench. Yeah, I don't think a park bench actually does anything, but sure, we'll put a park bench in there. Alright, uh, that's going to be one hell of a project that they will get done after they have planks, etc. Which is not till after the drought officially ends. Um, also means we can get these explosives done after the drought officially ends. As for this dist district, this district should have been powering along. They have the first row of houses in. That's about it so far. Uh, they did get in their woodwork, uh, wood warehouses, uh, which means they can store 400 wood currently. They're running low on food. Hmm. Turns out up in the population leads to a food problem. Um, can I put in... The problem is you're not really farming properly. Uh, you have too much farmland and not enough farmers. Can I just demolish that mess? Yeah, can I put in a farmhouse here? Uh, ideally there. Can I hook that in there instead? And we will demolish that that okay with that done we can put in a farmhouse here that should fix our food problem uh we'll max out the priority on that so it gets done uh also means that we will might as well plant in some extra carrots because we can like so all right uh that should fix their problem um yeah technically we could farm out to here somewhere uh, that's all berries. Uh, that's the campfire which we could move because this doesn't have to actually be there. Um, yeah, we'll worry about that later. And you have four beavers sleeping on the ground. Well, that was unexpected. Uh, okay, I guess uh, we have the stairs to here. You got two out of 35 logs. Uh, we'll take you off the bottom priority then. Uh, in fact, I'll actually give you a priority one. Because I prefer it if my beavers didn't sleep on the ground. Just, just, just saying, just saying. All right, drought has officially ended. Uh, we need to have the water reflow. And then, then we can turn back on the pumps. We can turn back on the power. And we can get things moving and grooving again. Well, it took all the way through the second day of the drought before um, we actually end up positive on power. Um, these guys even had to kick in and start doing something. Um, we seem to have added a lot of power demand in the last day or so. Uh, yes. Which means these guys are very slowly charging. On the side note, I still have the wheels running. Um, we, we, we might have hit a power limit. Uh, which is unfortunate because there's definitely more I want to do. Uh, we're going to pause all those guys. Uh, as for... So, we need dynamite to continue up here. Uh, we have injured beavers. We have a directive, hopefully, to get this stuff done. Uh, we're going to set a low priority on those, because they don't matter. Um, 
we may need to no because they can't build the warehouse till they have the structure underneath it okay uh we're gonna have a low priority on those as well the hope is we can get the healer up and running uh it doesn't need power thankfully uh we can have a low priority on everything back here as well it's not important uh whatever's under there because yes i just really want to get the healer up and running uh that one 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 and that one as well uh which also means that and that uh that tile in there that tile in there and that tile in there unfortunately it's planks and planks is one thing that we just don't have any of and won't have for a day or two i guess uh until well the plank machines actually get running up to full speed uh overnight we will definitely recharge the batteries with some oomph as for this district uh we have the second row of houses in which means they have plenty of spare room for spare beavers not that they have worked for them. Um, we are doing a good job of clearing, clear cutting the back of the island. We do have the second farm up and running, which should alleviate our food problem. All beavers are going to start starving. One of the two. We finally got a thirsty beaver in him, who is now producing uh, medicine uh, using what one dandelion, one bit of water, and point two of a wood gives us two medicine. So hopefully our medical treatments problems are solved. On top of that, um, we have a strain of beaver in 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 the absence colony um they are on a mid-level so they're stuck they're stuck stuck um so matthew uh i make it a policy not to save uh stupid beavers so unfortunately you are gonna um be left here and just be um buried into the housing block yes uh we also managed to where are we uh we managed to get our first layer of dynamite up here also we managed to levy off this section so we can now come in here and uh plant maple chestnuts chestnuts maybe mm, we'll stick to maple we'll stick to maple uh yep we can plant that whole area full of maple at the same time uh we can at least knock the first layer off this Cool. Uh, which now means we need to add some stairs to get the beavers down and uh, head back into here and layer it up for the next layer. Uh, at the same time, we have nothing to do in range. Uh, we have a problem accessing metal. Uh, it's not a problem with reach. It's a problem with one, two, three, four. Uh, we can only have four beavers. Maybe more. Maybe they can reach diagonally as well. Uh, one, two, three, four four five six six beavers six beavers accessing metal at the same time one two three four five six yeah six uh we can only have six beavers getting into the metal at once which means um we're all we're, we're, we're getting close on running out of metal which means in the next episode we need to do something about that we need to set up this district after we do a little bit of explosives uh we also are gonna have uh mass storage hopefully up and running by then um, I just realized that one needs to go away as well. Uh, hopefully we have mass storage up and running and by then. Also at the same time, I've noticed our population is um, slipping. We're, it's not going down, so to speak. It's just not going up. Uh, we do have um, some area down here. I'm going to blow up that little area. We can put in our new main set of stairs that are going to come down. Um, we do have some areas we can put in more breeding pods. Uh, I also need to do more optimizations around here. And we also have a potential issue. 1,300 horsepower? Oh, okay. Yeah, we're, we're, we're using 1,300 overnight, which is those two using 800. And I have no idea where the rest of it's going. Oh, into you. Yes, either you, you run day and night. Ooh, okay. Uh, so, we, we, we definitely have some projects for the next episode, but it means I need to leave this here. We have many explosives we need to make. We have many beavers uh, that we need to uninjure. Uh, hopefully, with some medical treatment, they will get much better, which means Thirsty Beaver uh, needs to stop drinking the medicine and start giving it to the beavers. I'm sure it has a high ethanol count with it, uh, but we will all find out all those details in the very next episode. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Do Hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you in the very next episode of Timberborn with me and Judy. All right, bye.